Hey, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this tutorial, we'll look at the Apple Dynamics Processing audio unit for Mac OS inside Adobe Audition. Okay, here we are with a voiceover that could do with a bit of compression. Where the music never stops. So let's apply in Effects Menu AU, Apple, the Dynamics Processor. Looks fairly similar to the Adobe Audition Processor, but you can see some visual stuff going on as you use it. Where the music never stops. And there we go, in real time we can see it working, so let's just move this around. Where the music never stops. So you've got the threshold here that you're moving up and down at the moment, so I can move the threshold down to make it a harsher compressor. Where the music never stops. And you can see every time it's rolling up to the top, that means it's going above the threshold. The music never so I can set this to just the perfect kind of threshold. Where the music never stops. So that's just a tiny bit there, and I can move this down so it's more of a, a hard knee compression. Where the music never stops. And I can get that just right for me. Once I have done that, drill down into the details. We can change the attack time if we like, and the release time. Uh, turn the master gain up because it's got rather quiet. Where the music never stops. Where the music never stops. And now, Where the music never stops. We start to see that the Dynamics Processor has had a great effect there on Mima's voice. Uh, if we then go to multi-track and we bounce down to new track, the selected track, you will see just what kind of a, an effect it has had on the voice. It's turned it from uh, a rather small, tiny waveform to a nicely compressed waveform using the wonderful Apple Dynamics Processing inside Adobe Audition on macOS.